Hi friends, we have created a data frame here. Uh, how you have created, what is the source of data frame, you can watch our previous video. We have just copied the code and used it. Now our data frame is ready. We will apply some common basic methods to our pandas to understand our data frame. Now let us first uh, find out how many rows and columns are there. We will say df save. Now this will tell us number of rows and columns are there. So 35 rows, 4 columns. This is a tuple actually. So we can get the number of rows by first element attempting. So 35. Now let us say 1. 1 means number of columns. This is 4. So this is a tuple. Now let us say uh, get the first 4 rows of the, our data. So we will say head. I will say 4. So we will use head for that. So for uh, df, sorry, this I missed the end. Fine. So first four is displayed. Four rows of data is displayed. Now suppose I want to know, you can use the lane also to know how many total number of uh, rows or records are there. So you can see here lane is 35. 35 records are there. Now what are the columns uh, available in this? That I can get by columns. So this will give us a list of columns available. So you can see these are all my columns. Now let us uh, uh, try to display some records now. Now let me display some first 5 records. 0 to 5. Now here it is, you say 5 records are displayed. Now only I want the name column of these 5 records to be displayed. So I can say name, name column only. So that's all, let's see. Okay, the only the name column is displayed. Now similarly I want that, uh, let all the columns be displayed, but display me from the 10th to 12th. So starting from 10 ends with 12th. So uh, 2 records of I can say okay, 11 and 12 were displayed. Now let us go to, towards the end. So display me the last record. So I will say minus 1 and let us display this. You can see this is my last record. Now let us start last 5 records. These are the last 5 records I can display it. Next we will move on the order or highest lowest like that. Let us display the top 5 records based on our mark column. So we will just delete this. We will say our df equal to df dot sort values we will use this function. So in that which column we will apply, we will apply it to our mark column. And the option is ascending equal to false. Now this df is uh, there. So values mark ascending equal to false. Fine. So now we'll print. We have already seen how to display the first five records. So we'll say five. Let's see what's the output. Uh, 96, 94, 1990. So these are all the first five records. Who is the first record? We can say make it one. So we'll go for 33. Fine. Now let's say who is the second highest in this. So we can say starting from one two records let's see 1294 this is the second highest so like that we can get now let's see who is the uh, lowest mark we got it so minus one now we'll say sorry minus one here we'll put it so the minus one is 18 at the serial number or id is 19 so this is how we can use the uh, you can sort it the values now let's say we don't want that but uh, what we want is uh, we want what are the unique classes are there you have to use unique there list out all the classes so we'll say print df now we'll say class class column now unique now this will print us 674 these are all the classes available and it takes the unique values from our class column 